Hello all! Happy Chinese New Year! Or if it's any other day, happy... Day? Also, Pekora BGM because it's the year of the rabbit. For those who don't know, I am pretty bad at my own mother tongue. Chinese? Hell, I even forgot how to write this basic ass word, which means her a little while ago. So, as a quick little revision, and for a short video, I'm going to relearn some phrases to greet my elders for Chinese New Year. For those who don't know, the youngins are supposed to greet their elders with Mandarin oranges with well wishes in sets of two idioms in exchange for that sweet, sweet cash inside what you know as a red packet or ang bao. This process is called bai nian, so stick around and learn a thing or two for this year of the rabbit. And for those non-Chinese speaking peeps who are looking to visit their friends' homes this holiday, maybe you'll come up with a couple of ang baos yourself. Let's start with the more general ways of greeting. Sing Yan Hao, which means Happy Chinese New Year. It's usually used when entering someone else's home to greet everyone at once, typically used by the extroverts leading the rest of the visiting group in. Sing Yan Kuai Le, which also means Happy Chinese New Year, but it's used in a more personal context when greeting your elders one to one. Gong Si Fa Tai, which means Happiness and Prosperity. Another phrase usually used when entering a home, although I prefer the Cantonese version which sounds way cooler. Gong hei fok toi. Now let's go on to what you use in the second half of your personal greetings. Sen ti jian kang, which means wishing you good health, is usually used for the more elderly people, or you can mess with the people who are sick quite often. Wan shi ru yi, which means may everything go well for you. This is my go-to phrase when I'm greeting someone I don't know or I forget what I want to say. Ping ping an an, which means peace and safety. Another easy fallback phrase. I use it more on middle-aged parents rather than on the elderly. Cai yan guang jing, which means prosperity to you. It's to be used on people who seem hard-focused on their career, like businessmen or businesswomen. Xue ye jing bu, which means improvement in your academics. It's usually used to people that are still studying. Most people will reply to your greetings with this phrase while handing you a red packet. And finally, onto this year's seasonal greetings. Tu Nian Kuai Le, which means Happy Year of the Rabbit. The most basic phrase. The first word can be interchanged with the different animals of the zodiac. Tu Nian Sing Wang, which means Prosperity in the Year of the Rabbit. Another basic rabbit year one. Special ones don't seem so special. Now let's end off with something big. Tu Nian Hao Yun Dang Bu Zhu Tu Nian Cai Yuan Gun 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 Lai. Try saying that ten times fast. Shut up! You can't get it right on the first try too. It means unlimited wealth and good luck in the year of the rabbit can't be stopped. Well, that's all the Chinese I want to put up with for the rest of the year. And wishing you the fattest, thickest of rib packets to line your pockets this year. Happy Lunar New Year, everyone! And I'll see you next time. Take care, everybody. King Crazy! Hey, you made it to the end of the video. Remember, like and subscribe. And since you're already here, why not watch another?